her surgery and stuff until she went to Hebrew home. But she's talking at the second place yeah, that she went to. Right. But the, the thing is, we're sitting outside. It's a beautiful day. It's in the summer. And she says a couple of things. First, she says, thank you. Hmm. And I say, what? And this in all the years, I felt guilty because yeah. I said yes to surgery. But she, she gave her version. But this is long before uh -huh. this conversation with me. And I said, and what are you thanking me for? She says, because Uncle Jack told me if it wasn't for you, I wouldn't be here. Mm -hmm. Aww. Okay, because I said do, do the surgery. Mm -hmm. And she thought what would happen if she didn't have the surgery, she'd be a vegetable. She didn't think that she, maybe she would right. get through. Right. And she wasn't a vegetable. And right. actually in this, in this tape, she's considering pretty, everything, she's, she's pretty quite lucid, good. Right? Yeah. She's yeah. really quite good. I mean, listening yeah. to her... Yeah. How she she's not hesitating for words. Wow. Um, she's not using very small words she's necessarily. No, she's she's and, 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 and it was kind of amazing. She's expressing. And the other thing she says to me, because she was having, she just had her 87th birthday, mm -hmm. and she said something like, "I know with this birthday that I'm old, some people, and I know if I look in the mirror that I look old." But she says, I don't feel old. Mm -hmm. I said, so what is old? She says, I'll tell you when, when I, I get, get there. there. Oh. Yeah. And I, I have to tell you, in this this last birthday, it was, it was an interesting number. For it's us? A, yes. It's not 75. What man? Yeah. 74 is a weird number mm -hmm. that, mm -hmm. that has had some impact on me in a positive way. So the next thing she says, oh, no, another thing that happened, some woman's walking. Now, our mother couldn't walk because she lost her left side, and mm -hmm. she could have in the beginning, but whatever. <coughs> Except when, um, strokes took that away. So there's a woman walking totally in an L shape with a walker. And she says, isn't that a shame? She says, I don't walk like that. <laughs> wow. Oh. After eight, seven, eight, nine and years I in said, a wheelchair. That's right. You know, somebody oh, else would say, walking. well, mom, you don't walk. I said, that's right. You that's don't right. walk like that. <laughs> you stand, you sit straight. Right. Yeah. <laughs> so, I didn't say anything. Oh. I just know. <laughs> she always had a way mm -hmm. of looking at things like that. Yeah. I love that. So then, but the last thing she said, I said, so it's okay with you to have to live the type of life that you've been living? And she said something like, wouldn't have been my choice. She says, so I said, what keeps you going? And you guys know, you've heard this. She says, I'm not ready not to see my daughter's faces. Mm -hmm. And that's what kept her going. Mm. Yeah. Mm. She, she didn't say her daughter. Yeah, she said her, her daughters. daughters. And I said, and that's enough for you? She said, yes. Wow. wow. But this wow. was the one. Right. Yes. Because she well, said every you know, day, because I look up and I see, I mean, no, it, the first year, two years, two tough. years at it least. Tough. It would be for anybody. Even yeah. though that nursing home was not near her, she went every day. Mm -hmm. The trip would have been maybe, what, 20 minutes if there was no traffic? When she was 17 miles the way. second one, yeah. it could have been 40, 45 minutes mm. every day. Yeah, but e yeah. either way. No, yeah. we went every night after work, never made a meal during the week because wow. it was too late. Right. On the weekends I went, my husband stayed home. But... Um, I think the real thing is is that I stayed. Mm -hmm. I stayed <coughs> in Hartford. In, mm -hmm. in Hartford. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. I, we were mother and daughter, but at times we were friends. Mm -hmm. um, we didn't, we didn't um, run one another's lives. Mm -hmm. I mean, she knew, yeah, she would like to hear, hear, have me call her every day, or if she wanted me to call her when I got to the office, if we had a snowstorm, mm -hmm. and I would say to her, I will call you if we have a snowstorm, but if you need to hear from me at other times, I'm not going to say you're going to hear from me on Tuesday or Wednesday, because if I don't call, right. you'll get nervous. I said, right. if you need to talk to me more than once a week, unless for some reason mm -hmm. we're both calling back and mm -hmm. forth, you can call me. Good mm -hmm. for you. But she created, when she retired, she created a life that she never had before, because she could do whatever she yeah. wanted, and it was she beautiful. Loved it. it was. And she was busy, and truthfully, at times she was more busy than I was yeah. before she got sick. Mm. But 